go. We're at the Heldenplatz in Vienna, Austria, and behind me is the balcony where Hitler stood to give his speech when he annexed Austria. Oh my god, it's raining. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and my camera is gonna die. <laughs> We're right here. It's a very short uh, tram ride. Only one fart each. <laughs> I have to choose between one fart or two farts, and I chose two. <laughs> I got another fart with me here. I don't know. Fart jokes are just funny. <laughs> Anyways, we're in Vienna, Austria, and we are heading to what neighborhood? Uh, the Kundertwasser House. So Ooh, it's windy today. Yeah, it's very windy. Oh my god. So we're gonna go check it out. It's got some like really funky exterior aesthetics. There should be trees on the roofs of the houses and so yeah. it we'll be go fun check time. it out and get some coffee. Ooh, look at that. Oh, this is so unique. Coffee at the Kunstcafe. <laughs> Yes, and it's the only possibility to see the inside of the building. Yeah. Um, I gave it this information, perhaps you have some friends. If you do come to uh, the Hundert Basel House, come to Kunz Cafe. Uh, there's a free video they show that gives you kind of a tour of the inside of the building, which is really cool. Um, and the lady who runs the shop, so nice, so sweet. village. Let's go check it out. I really like the, the philosophy behind it. We're very out of touch with nature and so taking natural elements and working that into the architecture and the way that something's built, I really think is cool, so. I think the one thing that really makes me uh, feel good about it is uh, our house is from the 30s and none of it is in a straight line, so Hunterwasser would love our house in Seattle. By the way, it's Rishi's birthday today, so. Happy birthday, Rishi! <laughs> We're saying goodbye to the Hunderwasser house and heading to the inner stock and check out some sites. Where are we going, Melissa? This one. We go to the Heldenplatz. Yeah, I just don't know where it is on the map. Is it by the Hofburg what? Vine? Yeah, it's right there. We found Tiger King. <laughs> I will never financially recover from this. That balcony over there, that's where Hitler stood and gave his famous speech when he annexed Austria in 
1936, 1937, 1938. Where are we going next, Melissa? We are going to St. Charles Church. But let me confirm that that's the actual name. <laughs> it is St. Charles Church. Oh. Oh, I was right. Well, we're getting better at this. Yes, so St. Charles Church. Um, so this one is another domed church. Uh, so it should be pretty beautiful on the inside, but we don't know because we haven't seen it yet, so. All right. our tour of St. Charles Church. It reminded me of like Rome, like churches in Rome. Oh, uh, like in the Vatican? Yeah. yeah, like in the Vatican, I would say it's very similar. Very nice. Right. On to the, onto the next palace yes. or church or whatever we're doing, I don't know. <laughs> I think we're gonna go to a palace next, go see some of the gardens for free because we're still pretty cheap, so. We're cheap. I'm cheap. <laughs> I'm the only cheap one. <laughs> Oh, so symmetrical. That is amazing. That's pretty impressive. So is the wind. <laughs> the wind is crazy, but Vienna has been awesome. Thank you, Vienna. We'll see you again probably at some point. So. Used to be a uh, rebel in India. Out here in Austria. <laughs>